a tiny little minuscule little petite TK Maxx haul. I totally went blank there for a minute. Uh, this is not like my usual hauls and I'll tell you why it's a little bit different. No recipe and no bag. So I've just got three things went to TK Maxx. When did we go to TK Maxx? Monday? Hey. Yeah, was it Monday? Yeah. You probably, oh, you probably would have just seen the shop with me footage. Of course, I did do a, a really quick little mini run through the, the store with pram cam. You were on that too, weren't you? You were helping mummy out with pram cam. So, no bag, <laughs> no recipe, but I do believe we've got prices on items. And here we go, I only got three items, but um, yeah, TK Maxx is quite new to our area, isn't it? And what happens with our area is that uh, we get a new shop or a new set of shops and everybody flocks there and you cannot like not get there and you know within five minutes all the shelves are gone. So we what's the matter? You want this? Do you want that? No. This particular store has been open for a few months and I go in there every now and then to have a look and I thought um, might as well see what's there on Monday. Actually Mick was with me too and so was Coops. So, but we only got a few things um, and by few I mean three. We only got three things. Um, what I love about TK Maxx is that they're continually turning their stock over. What I don't like about TK Maxx is, it's actually it's more about me, <laughs> is that if you if I go to TK Maxx and I go, oh, I don't want to spend that much now, I'll think about it, it's a considered purchase or, uh, you know, whatever. The next time we go, it's not there. Uh, it happened specifically with one thing around Mother's Day. There was a drinking flask, uh, like a, I'll put a picture up of what I mean. Um, that says Nana on it or Nana's flask or, or something like that. Uh, I was going to get it for mum because she, you know she's she, 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 <laughs> she sells seashells. She's the first time Nana and you know anything I see that says Nana I want to get her you know. She's waited long enough to, to get that title. Um, yeah I waited too long and of course when I went back it was not there. So listen to me <laughs> get it when you want it <laughs> okay um so we are going on holidays in november so we're in july right now we're going in november uh in australia the later part of the year is the warmer part of the year cooper turns one in september so he will be one by the time we go away and we're going to somewhere really nice with beaches and there'll be swimming and lots of different outdoor activities and what I saw and what I found in TK Maxx was lots of things for the summer season. So I saw this and automatically I was attracted to it because A, it has flamingos on it. Uh, and B, I'm a complete flamingo fanatic. Uh, I've got a tattoo of a flamingo. Uh, let me know if you want a tattoo tour because both Michael and I are tattooed. So you let me know. Anyway... Stop rambling. Here it is. It's a beach bag. So what we've got here is, did you see this? You were there when we got it. It's got flamingos on it. Wow. Cool, huh? So it's a beach bag. And as you can see, it's all meshy here. So, you know, towels, clothing, etc. It's got a front pocky. I'm really probably not showing this too well. It's got a front pocket with a zip. It's got a back pocket with a zip. Let's see how far you can get into this. Oh yeah, I could fit my hand in there. And it zips up the top. It's got Velcro shoulder protecty strap or hand protecty thingy. And but, oh, it's got gel silica in it. Blech, I hate that shit. Anywho, we'll get rid of that. The 
best thing about this bag is, I'm going to have to put it down, hang on. I need a table or something here. Are you watching Mummy on Struggle Street? Oh my gosh. Zipper's killing me. There we go. All right. So it's got like an insulated part. So we can put bottles. Yeah, you, I think you'll still be drinking bottles then, do you? I don't know. I'm a first time parent. Who the hell knows? Will you still be drinking bottles then? Even if it's not, we can bring a pouchy or whatever. So there's that. Look at that! It's shiny. It's thermal. Cool, huh? Get this. Good boy. Yeah. Sandwiches. Ice packs. I've got this thing where I cannot drink. Ollie. I cannot drink a cold drink. or A drink's meant to be cold. Unless it is ice cold. Even in the winter time, is that weird? I don't care if it's weird. It's my personal preference and that's what it is. Hmm. So anyway, so that really appealed to us. I'm just going to zippy it back up so you can get the full picture. Back on Struggle Street. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, the bloody silica shit came out. Oh, I hate that. Oh, I'm going to stand up and model it. Yeah, look, it's a good size. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Beach bag. TK Maxx. It is called Natural Elements Contemporary Living. Hello. Insulated beach bag. Oh, what's the matter? What's the matter? Ah, uh, okay. So it was originally... $24.99, which I already think is a pretty good deal, but we got it for 18 bucks. So that's not bad. Are you doing a poo on camera? Beach bag. Awesome. Next! I love a candle. And this is a gorgeous candle. I'm going to come up really close. It's like got beautiful glitters and it's sparkly and here take a whiff this is DW home richly scented candle and it's hand poured burn time is approximately 33 hours is that 33 no 35 tiny little writing uh, and the scent is called island lay so I wouldn't have called it Island Lay. As a matter of fact, when I smelled it in store, it smelled like a Christmas pine tree. And I love that smell. Um, let me smell again. It totally smells like a Christmas tree. Fine. Beautiful. Glass. Tin. Metal. Beauty. Okay. The last item is going to be of no use to you at all because I already peeled the price sticker off so I don't even know how much it was and yes I know I was only there Monday but I, I can hardly retain anything these days. So but I'm still going to show you. This, it's another candle of course, obsessed. This is also by DW Home and it's meant to like kind of look like one of those boba or you know bubble tea drinks with the like you know put your straw in there and yeah so I'll take the lid off and you have a whiff <sighs> pineapple sunrise tea that's what it says pineapple sunrise tea scented candle what other information have we got coops nothing that's it It smells exactly like pineapple juice. Couldn't tell you how much it is because I've already peeled the sticker off. I'm going to say it was around $13, the same as the other candle. I don't know. Oh, lost my train of thought. Oh, that's what I was going to say. We call it T 
TK Maxx, but is it called TJ Maxx somewhere else? I'm pretty sure it is. Yes, dear. What is it? You can't have this candle. You're too young for candles. Mwah! Mwah! Now you've got lipstick on your fingers. Oh, no! Yeah, TK Maxx, TJ Maxx, T something Max. It's still M A W X though. I think it's T J Max in America or over that side of the world. There's T K Max with a double X here in Australia. Why is that? Does anyone know? Please let me know. I mean, I'm not going to lose sleep over it, and I probably could just Google it. But let me know if you know. Pineapple sunrise tea. So again, I can't tell you the total. I can't even show you a recipe. I can't even put the stats up on the screen because mama dropped the ball on this one. So I really do apologize. But if you're after something that smells like pineapple, something that smells like a Christmas tree or a beach bag with flamingos, go right ahead to TK Maxx or TJ Maxx or wherever you live, go there. Another thing, and this is something that I told you, there are flamingos everywhere there on Monday. I am so glad that it is coming back as a trend. So yes, dear, can I help you? Are you trying to rough me up? Are you trying to scruff me up? How dare you? I'm just going to do the rest of the video like this. Flamingos are coming back. Hallelujah. I love flamingos. And I mean, it's very obvious. Actually, I might do a video of how many flamingos I have in my house. We are in Cooper's nursery right now. And I can count three, four, just four at the moment, just four, five including the one on my arm. Do you, oh, you want my string. Okay, you have my string while mummy finishes this up. Thank you for being in my videos, by the way. I love that you're in them. That's it. I can't think of anything else to say. Which is really surprising for me because I can talk underwater. You can have that string. It's not for babies. Ah! I'm going to have fingerprints on my glasses now. I can't see. <laughs> That's it. TK Maxx. TJ Maxx. Side note. Bravo to all the YouTubers who use a ring light. All I can see everywhere I look are rings now. Are you right? Rings everywhere. Lord of the Rings. Bye.